Praise be to the Most High God and glory. If someone is mistreating you and keeps repeating the same offenses, a gift from them cannot amend or make up for their offenses against you. A gift does not always have to be a physical object. It can also represent a form of special treatment, affections, or favors. Either way, none of those things can replace loyalty or faithfulness. In fact, an honorable, righteous person will refuse a gift from someone mistreating them or being unfaithful and unloyal to them because they perceive their gift as a bribe to keep accepting bad behavior. No righteous person will put up with disloyalty or betrayal. They will abandon such a person. What a righteous person desires is faithfulness and loyalty. So if a person wants to make amends with someone honorable, they must first sit down and count the cost. Write down their offenses and decide if they are willing to give up their transgressions. And if that be their will, they must then ask for forgiveness and repent by changing their bad behaviors. And then, after they give up their offenses, their gifts will be accepted and appreciated. This is exactly how God Almighty feels towards His children. He requires obedience. God will not hear the prayers of a person doing wicked. Their sacrifices and gifts will not be accepted. If they are repeating the same sins, He requires their obedience first. Obedience is better than gifts or sacrifices. One must sit down and count the cost and make a conscience decision on whether they are willing to give up their transgressions or continue on the path to destruction that keeps their prayers from being heard or answered and then if they decide to repent and do the will of God Almighty by keeping His law, His everlasting covenant by obeying His commandments, statutes, and decrees then if they truly change and depart from evil God will accept their gifts, offerings, and sacrifices and then their prayers will be heard. And they will receive joy from their Redeemer. True love is obedience, faithfulness, loyalty. Serving God in spirit and in truth. This is the kind of love God requires. May God lead His children into all truth. Praise Yahweh, Most High. Kiss the King, King David, the Son of the Most High that is appointed to be our king, our prince, and lead us to the path of righteousness. Also known as Yahshua, spelled as Jesus in the Bibles, of today. Thank you for stopping by. Don't forget obedience is better than sacrifice.